Mending Fences, Rebuilding Relationships in English. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English idiom, time to mend fences. This phrase is rich in imagery and meaning, and understanding it can add depth to your English communication. So, if you've ever wondered about mending fences, not in a literal sense, but in building bridges in relationships, you're in the right place. The phrase, time to mend fences, originates from the physical act of repairing the barriers or fences that separate properties. This act is symbolic of repairing or improving relationships that have been damaged by conflict or misunderstanding. When we say it's time to mend fences, we're acknowledging that it's time to heal rifts, resolve differences, and restore harmony in a relationship. Mending fences is crucial because it focuses on reconciliation and healing. In personal and professional relationships, conflicts can arise, leading to a breakdown in communication and trust. By choosing to mend fences, individuals take proactive steps towards forgiveness, understanding, and rebuilding the bond that was strained or broken. This phrase emphasizes the importance of taking action to repair relationships rather than letting misunderstandings fester. Mending fences requires more than just recognizing the need for repair. It involves concrete steps towards reconciliation. Here are some ways to mend fences. 1. Initiate communication. Reach out to the other person to express your desire to resolve the issue. 2. Acknowledge the problem. Both parties should recognize and admit their part in the conflict. 3. Offer and seek forgiveness. Apologize for any wrongdoing and be ready to forgive the other person. 4. Discuss solutions. Work together to find ways to prevent similar issues in the future. 5. Rebuild trust. Take actions that demonstrate commitment to the relationship and rebuild trust over time. To help you grasp how to use time to mend fences in conversation, here are a few examples. After a heated argument with a friend, you might say, I think it's time to mend fences. Let's talk and move past this. In a business setting, a manager might tell two team members, it's time to mend fences and work together effectively for the project's success. Reflecting on a family dispute, one might conclude, it's time to mend fences with my sibling. Family is too important. We hope this video has shed light on the beautiful idiom, time to mend fences, and its significance in nurturing and repairing relationships. Remember, taking the first step towards reconciliation can lead to healing and stronger bonds. Thank you for watching and we hope this lesson helps you navigate your relationships with greater empathy and understanding. Keep learning, and see you in the next video.